Hey guys, it's Pete from Crunch Time Coaching. I wanna talk US Open a bit and I wanna ask you guys a question. So here's a question, whether you're a Facebook or a YouTuber or both, I wanna know, is Andy Murray right now, I know the rankings don't say so, is he the number one player in the world? Is he the guy to beat at the US Open or is it still Novak Djokovic? Earlier this year I made a video on Novak is the greatest ever, possibly, but and I still think so. I still think he's amazing. I think he's, he's, he's just having a great year. But he's certainly, second half of the year from Wimbledon on, he's struggled a bit, lost early at Wimbledon, just seems a bit burned out to me. And now Murray's back with Lendl and he seems to have his mojo back. Really, really tough. Won Wimbledon, won the Olympics, goes to the Cincinnati exhausted and gets to the finals, loses to a hot Marian Cilic. So is Murray the guy to beat? I'm gonna leave that up to you guys, right? Number one, because I don't want you guys just clowning and bagging on me, which you'll probably do anyway. But uh, I wanna really just know your opinion. I'm gonna try and, and keep my opinion out of the debate, leave the debate open on YouTube. Last time we did that, we had a ton of responses. Is Murray now the number one player in the world not by ranking, but just by you know how hot he is going to the U.S. Open, and is he the guy to beat, or is it still Novak, or is somebody else going to be the dark horse? Is Chilich going to come out of nowhere and give another two-week run? Want to know your thoughts? And uh, please make sure to comment below, uh, like this video, share it with your friends. Let's have let's have a a internet debate all over the internet on who is right now the hottest player on the tour going into the U.S. Open. This is Pete from CrunchTimeCoaching.com. Hey, stop off. there. This is Pete from Crunch Time Coaching, and today, today I want to give you a modern tennis makeover on the forehand. I've got a five-part free train series that is going to cure most of the problems I see from recreational players over the age of 40. Most recreational players lack the desired spin, parent control they want because of inferior, outdated stroke technique. Funky grips, poor setup, and incorrect swing pass are killing your forehand. Sign up for my free five-part series, Modern Tennis Makeover, and start building a better forehand instantly by watching my first video on core power, which I promise is going to be an eye-opening experience. In video two, watch one of the biggest changes that's happened on the professional tour in the last seven years, used by your favorite pros, Djokovic, Federer, Murray, Nadal and it's used to dramatically shorten the swing cycle, yet increase racket head speed and power on the ball. In video three, I'm gonna show you how to absolutely murder your approach shot. In video four, I'm gonna show you why not only learning a swing volley is a costly mistake, but I'm also gonna show you how and when to use it. Finally, in video five, I'm gonna show you a disguised tossed and lob that's going to have your opponents walking on eggshells every time they approach the net against you. I promise fun, enjoyment, and improvement or your money back. Guys, it's absolutely free. You have nothing to lose and a modern forehand to gain. So click here to start training instantly and watch the first video on core power right now. We'll see you inside the free train series.